at home with Lucas here. So today we're gonna to be talking about Kigo blinds and in particular, we're gonna talk about their zebra shades. Yes, people, I finally got my hands on some no drill blinds. Yes, these things work just like a shower curtain. They have a spring inside of them that spring out and lock into place. You take a little Allen wrench that's provided with the blinds, you turn it to lock it into place. No drilling, no holes. If you're renting, this is perfect for you. If you're someone who is swapping out blinds all the time because you're picky and you just want to find the best ones for you, this is absolutely amazing. Easier to put in than a shower curtain. So let's talk about some of the details. These things have 2,400 milliamp hour batteries. That's gonna give you 300 up and down open and closing of the blinds. That's gonna last you just about six months. And if you don't use it that much, meaning some days you just don't open your blinds at all, it's gonna last you even longer. These things are absolutely amazing. They come with a remote control that's gonna allow you to control a huge amount of blinds, up to 15. These blinds are made out of premium materials, so you're gonna get that window darkening that you want, that you need, and you're gonna get that premium look, so they're gonna look really stylish. They also have a very, very quiet motor and the ability to push a single button and get all your blinds up. So if you have 15 blinds, you can push one button and bring them all up all at once. And once again, I cannot emphasize enough, no drilling. You're gonna be able to install these in a matter of minutes. So in this video, we're doing a hands-on with the box, quick unboxing and first impressions on said zebra shades. After that, I'm gonna be putting these bad boys to the Adam Lucas test to figure out, are they something you should buy or maybe skip altogether? Together. I'm here for you, so don't have to waste your time buying and returning. All right, let's go ahead and install. Okay, this is how the blinds come in a very small, compact box. Um, I kind of am liking the fact that it's a smaller box because I have to deal with a lot of boxes, but nonetheless, let's go ahead and get that opened and see what's inside. Okay, so everything is packaged really nicely in that box, um, very well put together really more like regular blinds than I've dealt with before with smart blinds. So these seem a little bit more like a regular blind than a smart blind, which is kind of nice. They're lightweight and they're very uh, well put together. So let's go ahead and open that up, take a closer look. The first thing you see is their remote right here. It's really nice. It looks uh, kind of space aged and cool. You have an up, down, uh, possibly a pause button, and then you have a plus and a minus button right there. And then you have the display right up top, which looks like you can go through all your different shades right there. Then it has a wall mount over here, which is a magnet. So it just magnetizes right on there. So you mount this on the wall here, and then you can just pop it off and you're good to go. Okay, after getting everything out of the packaging, this is what the blind looks like right here. It actually comes with the Allen wrench taped on it. So you're gonna basically just turn that Allen wrench. It's gonna push that out. So first impressions, pretty nice. Okay, these are our current blinds right here. They're just cheap $10 blinds that I got from the store. I'm gonna be pulling those down and we'll be installing the new ones. Okay, so the install is really simple. You have a grip on that side and then you have a grip on this side right here and it's got a spring in it, which is really cool. So it's spring loaded. So you push this side in first and then you put this side in second and then all you do is you just push it up. It's literally easier than putting up a shower rod. I kid you not, it is so simple. And then you just come over here with your Allen wrench and you just start tightening this until it feels snug and then you're good to go. Next up is pairing up the remote to get this bad boy working. Okay, so I wanna show you just how easy these things are to put up by taking one of them down. So you literally can just grab it and pull it off just like that, just like a shower curtain and boom, you can move this thing around your house, put it in another window. Um, really, really awesome, super easy. All right, and there we go. That is the after right there. These things look absolutely amazing. So much better than my last blinds. 
and the fact that you can put them in so many different positions really adds to the room and makes it look so much better. Okay, now we're in my loft right here and we have three of these wooden blinds right here. Uh, only one of them actually still works. Uh, I have to manually turn those two with my hand and that one I have to pull the string. So we're gonna be taking these down and putting up the new ones. Right, and there we go, that is the after right there. So these things do a great job of making this loft just look that much more premium. Definitely nice to have a real uniform look. And there's just something about these shades that really do look way more uniform than my last ones did, um, just because it's a motor bringing it down. It's always gonna be the same exact all the way across, which is great. Okay, let's take a minute to talk about the remote control. So this remote control is absolutely amazing. You can literally just put it on zero and press a single button and all your blinds will slowly start to come down all across your room. So there they go, a single press and they're all coming down and then you can simply just hit the pause button and boom, they're all paused in the exact spot you want them to be in. You can literally stop these on a dime. So if you wanna line up your zebra shades perfectly, you can, trust me. So this remote is super, super simple. You have your plus over here, which you can run through all of your different blinds. I do wish that you could set the limit. So let's say I only have six and I probably will only have six. I wish I could just set the limit at six and that way when I go plusing, I'm not running through all of these. So that's the only downside about this. I have to go through all that to get back to zero here. So definitely take note of that. Um, if you're not buying a huge amount of blinds, get a remote that doesn't go up to 15. I think they have another one out there, um, but very, very responsive. This is a super, super fast remote, um, super minimal. I love the look of it. It's absolutely amazing. It feels so good in the hand and to be able to just grab it straight off of your wall is a game changer people I've, I've never had a remote on my wall a day in my life and i will never go back i love this so much i think it looks amazing on the wall it really does a phenomenal job i like the fact that this goes completely blank and the ability to basically stand in my master bedroom doorway so the remote's here i pull it off let's go back to our favorite so you hold down the pause button here and now they're all going to go back to the favorite so i'm going to stand right here in the doorway i'm going to hold this down and then within a matter of minutes all of them all of them are going back up all across and I can even if my baby is napping I can just point this remote underneath the door and it will activate these shades in here so this remote is definitely next level it's definitely five out of five stars in my book I had zero problems with it so love 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 the remote All right, let's talk about room darkening. So let's go ahead and drop these down and take a closer look at how dark it's gonna make this room. So I'm not gonna adjust the camera at all. I'm just gonna stand right here. Um, I'll actually back up a little bit. You can see uh, the sun rays on the carpet right there. So once again, these make a little bit of a noise on the way down. They're super quiet on the way up. And they're actually quite fast. Um, so I like that a lot. So there you go on the carpet, completely gone. So any sunlight that's going to come in to damage your carpet or your furniture is going to be protected by these blinds. And you can see it's gotten a little bit darker in here. So it's just as good as normal uh, blinds that you buy the non darkening ones. These are actually not blackout shears. I think they do sell the blackout ones. Um, zebra blinds blackout. I didn't get those. I got the standard ones. So these are definitely good. They're just not going to block out a lot of light if we go over to the window itself you can see that it is doing a lot but it's not uh, gonna block 100% of that Sun right there but this is gonna allow for your room to not overheat so this is really good these things do a great job and if I come into my loft over here you can see it actually did a good job of darkening 
Okay, now I'm just gonna do the opposite. I'm gonna raise the blinds in the loft. So we'll go ahead and hit the button to send it to the favorite position. And there we go. They're all gonna go up. And you're gonna notice right away all the light that's coming in onto the carpet. My dog is obsessed with sunlight, so she will be very happy when these blinds go up. She'll find a spot and just lay in it. Beautiful thing about these blinds is I can literally send them all the way up. So we're gonna send them up a little bit more. And now what we're gonna get is full window. So you're gonna lose about three inches of your window up top, which is absolutely amazing. I don't know any blinds out there besides the really cheap ones that go up that far right there giving you so much more light. So there you go, so much light coming in the room. Really, really awesome. It darkens the room and then it brightens it right back up. Okay, let's talk about charging. So these things are super easy to charge. You literally just take the provided cable, plug it straight into the USB-C port and away you go, it's charging. And if you have curtains like I do, you won't even know that you're charging at all. So that is really awesome. Talk about this button right here, the M. So that's your multifunction button. You can literally just press it and the blinds will go straight up just like that. You press the button again and your blinds will stop. So if you don't have a remote or you're not near a remote, you can just come up, press this really fast, really easily and get these blinds up or down. So that's really awesome. I've been using these zebra blinds for long enough that I think I have a full comprehensive review. And let's just start off with the build quality. So these are made out of really premium materials. I definitely like the fact that you can see out of this. It's not as bad as some of the other ones. It looks a little bit worse on camera, but trust me, you are gonna be able to look out of this really easily. I definitely like the fact that this looks very minimal up here. It doesn't look too in your face. And of course, I love the fact that when you set them up like this, this is what I call accent right here. So it's just up super easily. They look really stylish and they let a lot of light in. And then with a single push of a button, you can have all of these drop down super fast. I love the fact that the bottom piece down here is nice and textured and it basically matches the shade up top and it's nicely weighted too. So they did a really good job on that. And the way that this thing drops all the way down is really, really nice. So all in all, I'm gonna say that these are great blinds. I'm gonna give them a solid 4.7 star rating. And I'm gonna say highly recommended to everyone out there that wants a very lightweight, easy to install, simple blind shade, whatever you wanna call it, buy it. All right, there you go. That's the Kigo blinds. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely click to clack that like button. And if you want to join the Adam Lucas family and you want to be a part of this crew, hit that subscribe button. Every time you get a subscriber, I get a boost to make more and more videos. And it's because of you guys, I surpassed 11K. Yes, people, on my way to 12K, but I need your help. Yes, you right there. Tell your friends, tell your family. This guy's on YouTube. They should go subscribe and watch my channel. But as always, I thank you for watching each and every one of my videos and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.